is it? It's about your durability, your mental strength, whether you can finish at maybe 11, 11.30 one night, get up again, go back in there at 10 a.m. and carry on where you left off or whether it mentally drained you. Because you see some of those lads come out of that arena at, you know, sometimes midnight. They look pale, they look shot to pieces. And you've got to go home, get a few hours kit and get back in there. So you're looking at the, you're looking at the titans again, like Selby, O'Sullivan. People like that. I think I have to say I think this year there's as many live contenders to win this great championship as probably any year I can remember in, in the recent past. Um, if I was having a, a little fiver, I, I do think Mark Selby and Judd Trump are both coming into this looking looking pretty good. Defending champion, obviously Mark Selby is going to have to end this this crucible curse of first time winner. But uh, I think those two will, will be in a lot of people's notebooks for this for this tournament. But of course, you know. There's a, lot of, there's a lot of people out there who could win it. My money's on Ding this year, Mark. I think he's not really done it at the Crucible before. He's had a really bad season. And usually people have had a bad season coming in, do very well. Um, and he's got to win it at some point. He's too good. He's won the UK, he's won the Masters. It's about time he won the world. And it'd be great for the audience of the game because there's so many fans in China. And of course, you can't discount Ronnie, Mark Selby, world champion. But Ding's my money. My money's on Ding this year. Who wins the Betfred World Snooker Championship? Got to be Rocket Ronnie, isn't it? Got to be Rocket Ronnie. I love my snooker. I really do love my snooker. Through the years, I've been sad enough to back the likes of Willie Thorne. I back the likes of Mike Hallett, Neil Folds. Um, come on, Rocket, do it again. Who wins the Betfred World Snooker Championship? There's only one man. I mean, I love Dennis Taylor and all that sort of stuff, but he's not playing this year. Ronnie! Go for it, big fella.